Alan Borders beside me. Were you surprised Ricky Ponting uh, decided to have a bat? Not really. It tends to be the way the Australians uh, like to play their... Well, I don't think you'd be able to take that attempt to hit the ball. We started to play it. They would have bowled had they won the toss. back into a major role in this test match batting lineup. He burst onto the scene with um, against South Africa last year. Played fantastically well and just lost his way in England. I thought it was a little unlucky to lose his place, but you can't moan about his replacement, Shane Watson. Been in awesome touch. Oh, that's a goodie. That's the length. That's the length that Chris Martin needs to hit. Well, this is a beauty. Oh, have to run here. Had to rush his shot, Phil Hughes. Just really jams down on the delivery. <laughs> but right out of the middle, doesn't even worry about running. Well, New Zealand will be looking to get the ball up there and try to use it, but so far they've been hit down the... Driven. Didn't get all of it. Not so much Kadic, but Hughes. So that he just keeps him named. Oh. Let me just have a look at this uh, last shot from Bill Hughes. That, it's, it's unorthodox, but incredibly effective. It's gone flat. And with the breeze, but it's just gone 100 miles an hour, just over the boundary rope. And so obviously hit something pretty. Oh, that's another good delivery. That's a really good way to finish the over. Australia, none for 66. Oh, that's four more. Four more, straight down the ground. Well, look at that. That is just stand and deliver.